Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So in this video, we are going to learn to knit this beautiful knitting stitch pattern. You can use this pattern in your both ladies and gents sweater and cardigan. This is how it looks like. See, it looks so beautiful. See. Wrong side looks like this. So this is only eight rows repeat pattern and you need to cast in multiples of six and plus three extra stitches and plus four as stitches. Multiples of six plus three extra stitches and plus four as stitches. For this pattern, you will need four as stitches, two as stitches here and two as stitches here, right? So let's begin. For the demonstration, I have 25 stitches on my needle which is uh, 6 plus 6 plus 6, 3 times 6, 18, and plus 3 extra stitches, 21, and plus 4 as stitches, 25. And here I have already done my border, and now we're going to start. So after you finish your border, row 1. For row 1, you slip your first add stitch as if to knit, and then knit your second add stitch. So we have done our as stitches here and then start the repeat from here. For repeat pattern, you slip three and knit three. That's the repeat pattern. So slip three, one, two, three, and then knit three. One, two, three. That's the repeat pattern. Slip three with the end in back slip three and knit three and you're going to repeat this repeat pattern for however many repeat stitches you have we have two more repeats here so i'm going to repeat that two more times again slip three one two three and knit three one two three again slip three one two three and knit three one, two, three. And we have finished our all repeats. We have done three repeats here. And after you finish your all repeats, uh, you will have two S stitches and plus three H stitches. Totally you have um, five stitches here. Now for these five stitches, you need three, sorry, slip three, one, two, three. And then knit your last two edge stitches. One, two. So we have finished our one, uh, sorry, row one, row two. For row two, you slip the slip stitches and purl the purl stitches. Slip your first edge stitch and then purl your second edge stitch. We have done our edge stitches. And now you slip, see this three stitches are slip stitches see you slip these slip stitches one two three and then purl these purl stitches one two three that's the repeat pattern from here to here for repeat pattern we have done slip three purl three repeat that again slip three one two three and purl three one, two, three. Last repeat. Slip three, one, two, three, and purl three. One, two, three. So we have finished our all repeats. And at last, you will have five stitches. Now for these five stitches, you slip three, one, two, three, and purl your last two add stitches one two we have finished our row one and row two now row three for row three you slip your first edge stitch and knit your second edge stitch we have finished our edge stitches and now start the repeat for repeat pattern you're going to do yarn over this way yarn over 
and then you knit these three stitches three slip stitches together through the back loop one two three three knit these three stitches together through the back loop and then yarn over again and knit three one two three let's repeat pattern yarn over knit three together through the back loop yarn over again and knit three again yarn over knit three together through the back loop knit these three slip stitches together through the back loop and then yarn over again and knit three one two three last repeat yarn over and knit these three slip stitches together through the back loop and yarn over knit three one two three we have finished our all repeats and for the last five stitches yarn over knit these three slip stitches together through the back loop and yarn over and then knit your last two edge stitches one two row four for row four you pull all stitches this is your yarn over pull this yarn over row 5 now on row 5 we're going to alternate these stitches now we're going to knit these stitches here and here and here so row 5 slip your first edge stitch and then knit your second edge stitch and then start the repeat from here now we're going to knit these three stitches for repeat pattern knit this these three stitches and slip these three stitches so knit three one two three and then slip these three stitches one two three that's repeat pattern knit three and slip three again knit three one two three slip three one two three knit three one two three slip three one two three and for the last five stitches knit three one two three and knit your last two add stitches one two row six for row six slip your first add stitch and then pull your second add stitch and now you prawl all the prawl stitches and slip all the slip stitches so start the repeat from here so we have here prawl stitches prawl three one two three 
and slip three. One, two, three. Again, crawl three. One, two, three, and slip three. One, two, three. Last repeat. Crawl three. One, two, three, slip three. One, two, three. And for the last five stitches, crawl three. One, two, three. And probably the last two add stitches. One, two. Row seven. For row seven, you slip your first edge stitch and then knit second edge stitch and then start the repeat. For repeat pattern, you knit three, one, two, three, and yarn over. Knit these three slip stitches together through the back loop. And yarn over. That's the repeat pattern. Knit three, yarn over, knit to knit three together, and yarn over again. Knit three, one, two, three, yarn over, and knit three slip stitches together through the back loop, and yarn over again. Last repeat, knit three, one, two, three, yarn over, knit three slip stitches together through the back loop. And then yarn over. So we have finished our all repeats and after we finish our all repeats for the last five stitches knit three one two three and knit your last two add stitches one two row eight last row purl all stitches So that's the repeat pattern. See? And now you repeat these eight rows, your row one to row eight, over and over again until you reach your desired length. And after your few repeats, your pattern looks like this. So please give it a thumbs up if you like this pattern and also subscribe to my channel. So I'll see you in my next video. Thank you for watching. Bye.